Hello everyone, welcome to this video about 10 ways age reversal will transform the world. In this video, we're going to talk about age reversal and how it's going to change the world in the coming years. Age reversal technologies have been the subject of study for quite some time, and while it may appear to be science fiction, recent advances indicate that age reversal may one day become a reality. So, how will age reversal change the world? Let's take a look at 10 ways. 1. Humans could maintain long-term viability due to genetic modification in nanobots. We could use some of the most innovative tools ever created, such as VR and AIs, to experience what it feels like to be millions of times more intelligent. We could also observe the emergence and collapse of governments, travel to every nation and metropolis on the globe, and investigate distant worlds in our solar system. 2. We may outlive our grandchildren by a great deal, but only a small portion of people would desire eternal life. We may survive much longer than most of our close friends and relatives, and may even live longer than our great-grandchildren and grandkids. Some individuals would be better able to deal with this contradiction than others. 3. People who are immortal may have a hard time adjusting to social change, as many of the traditions, viewpoints, and morals of people in the future may seem absurd to those who are alive today. Many of the rules that are essential to a functioning society may be abandoned after hundreds of years, and there may be new rules that seem totally absurd to us. After several millennia, those who have survived may come to be seen as being too antiquated by newer people, and immortal beings may hold dated opinions, standards, and tastes that are inconsistent with the modern world. The types of people, attire, and behaviors they would see if they were to stroll through Times Square in New York City from the 1700s would be completely alien to them. 4. Body parts would need to be replaced frequently due to the possibility of injuries and wear and tear on some bodily parts. 3D technology could be used to manufacture and harvest synthetic body parts, and by the end of this century, it may be normal to see people in public who look more like machines than people. Additionally, the strength, speed, and endurance of these mechanical forms could reach various degrees of superhuman power. We could replace these bodies as they deteriorate with fresh ones and carry on doing so for many millennia or possibly much longer. It may be impossible to determine a person's age in the distant future, whether they are 200 or 10,000 years old. 5. Our innermost selves are malleable and can be lost after living for many years. Major life occurrences may be forgotten, as well as actions we may have taken. We may need to put the memories in our heads onto recording systems or use holodecks, virtual worlds, and brain-computer interfaces to revisit those experiences whenever we want. 6. Dictators could have a devastating effect on the world if they were allowed to rule for a long time. This would include constant thought monitoring, harsh social credit systems, VR and brain-computer interface tools, and military machines prowling the streets. To defend themselves, these tyrants would be equipped with some of the most cutting-edge technologies, such as force fields, armor that can withstand bullets, and danger detection systems. They would also take steps to prevent their citizens from having access to those kinds of tools, and even if they did perish, they would have copies of their mind that could be transferred to artificial and robot bodies. Additionally, eccentric millionaires, heads of criminal families, sect leaders, and others would have access to life extension therapies. 7. The market for life extension treatment would reach $1 trillion, with nanotechnology providing an ongoing source of nanobots to eat. These nanobots would fight viruses and pathogens, and could eventually outperform our native defense systems. Genetic engineering could also be used to stop the aging process in various bodily systems. Depending on the maker, the user's present biological age, and the level of their total life extension package, the time interval for ingesting these substances may change. This life extension drug could be taken on a monthly, annual, or periodic basis, but overpopulation might result from this. 8. An increasing proportion of the population may decide to live eternally, leading to economic growth and a rapid expansion of the industry. However, non-enhanced humans may become marginalized in the job market and endure protracted jobless. Additionally, many people between the ages of 50 and 90 may decide to undergo therapy in the early years that radical life extension becomes feasible, allowing them to retain and amass vast sums of money that would otherwise have been used in other ways.
This could lead to unrest in many countries. 9. Investments in 401k plans, index funds, coins, real estate, and digital assets may increase in value forever as long as we live. If we put $1,000 into an investment with a 5% yearly yield and left it alone for 300 years, we would have amassed more than $6.5 billion. However, governments may restrict the number of years that we can engage in certain assets as a reaction to so many people living for so long. Replicators may also advance to become a common device at that period, and the financial markets on a worldwide scale and the entire capitalistic system could be drastically altered by this innovation. 10. Cryogenic preservation is a potential solution to enable long-distance space travel, but it would require a small, rotating staff that would likely continue to age. The risks involved with these trips would be reduced if people could live forever, so it is important to view the video about humankind's future. So, there you have it. Age reversal is a fascinating topic with tremendous potential for change. We'll have to wait and see how the future unfolds, but one thing is for certain. It's an exciting time to be alive. Thank you for watching the video, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.